I know, this video promised the Dutton family tree in 30 seconds, and you're looking at something that stretches well over six minutes. If you wanna jump right to it, I won't be mad. Find the time code in the description section of this video, and please consider tapping subscribe while you're down there. But before I explain how James Dutton, Jacob Dutton, and John Dutton are all related, I need to make a correction. Hey, it's Billy Dukes, and I was wrong. I went all in on James Dutton being the great, great, great grandfather to John Dutton, played by Kevin Costner, and the reason I did that was because of this. James is John's great, great, great grandfather. That's Taylor Sheridan, and he'd know, right? Eh, it turns out he does know, he just got confused. And we know that because of a scene from season five, episode one, when Jamie Dutton introduces Governor John Dutton as a fifth generation rancher. We know from watching 1883 that James is first, his kids are second, his grandkids are third, his great-grandson, as it turns out, is John Dutton Sr., played by Dabney Coleman. That guy is the John, played by Kevin Costner's father, which makes James the great-great-grandfather to John Dutton. That's less great, and it makes me wrong. It also makes Tate Dutton the seventh-generation Dutton, and I'm not going to get into why that's important, but if you know, you know. Now, like I said, the short version of this video can be found in the time codes in the description section below. Go ahead and jump right there if you want. But you'll miss the explanation for all the Duttons we have not met or not met yet. That includes Ned and Chance Dutton, plus Patience Dutton and Peter Dutton. It also clarifies a misconception about this woman. That's actor Don Olivieri, who plays Claire Dutton on 1883. She also doubles as Sarah Atwood on Yellowstone, a lot of actors play two, three, or even six roles across the Taylor Sheridan universe. It's kind of a thing. So let's get started with graphic number one of four. Obviously, James needed to come from somewhere, so I have two unidentified Duttons at the top of this thing. We now know that Jacob Dutton, played by Harrison Ford, is James's older brother. He also had a sister named Claire. Yeah, they were siblings. She was only identified as Margaret's sister-in-law during the show, but since her name is Claire Dutton, she has to be directly related to James. The only other option is that she married a second brother to James, but that wouldn't explain how her daughter, Mary, got the last name Abel. It would explain James's nonchalance when she dies in episode two of 1883, though. I agree that this theory comes with uh, loose ends, but one thing is certain, either Mary or Mary's late husband was kin to James. They're all dead now, so it doesn't really matter in the big picture. Not dead is Jacob. He's the star of 1923, and he's married to Kara, played by Helen Mirren. A long time ago, Yellowstone showed us tombstones for Ned and Chance Dutton. I think it was after Lee Dutton died in episode one of Yellowstone. Both lived in the late 19th century, and since they're not related to James, they must have come with Jacob when he rushed to Montana to try to save Margaret. This was explained during episode one of 1923, Jacob's kids aren't mentioned, but it's the only explanation for someone who lived during that time and died on the ranch. That's why I have both Chance and Ned as children to Jacob and Kara. Remember, Spencer, who Kara writes to often during 1923, and John Sr., who works on the ranch with Jacob, are the couple's nephews. That moves us to the final line of graphic number one. Note that John Sr. marries Emma, and together they give birth to... Jack. He is literally it for what I refer to as the red generation because that's the color I chose to use to represent him. In 1923, Jack is married to the beautiful Elizabeth Stratford, played by Michelle Randolph. What comes next is the green generation, and all we can do right now is speculate that John Sr., who is played by Dabney Coleman, is Jack and Elizabeth's kid. This would be the great-grandson to James, played by Tim McGraw. It's also possible that Spencer gets his life together and has a kid. In fact, he may end up fathering a little girl named Patience Dutton, whose tombstone we saw during season five of Yellowstone as Monica is burying her baby boy. For now, we're putting both John Dutton Sr., yes, this is the second John Dutton Sr., and Patience, under Jack and Elizabeth, it's the most sensible option. Patience, John Sr., and John Sr.'s wife are the green generation. John Sr. and an unnamed wife give birth to Kevin Costner's John and Peter Dutton. We learn all about Peter in season five of Yellowstone. He died as a baby. John marries Evelyn. 
Also part of this black generation is Garrett Randall and his wife who gave birth to Jamie Dutton, the child that John and Evelyn end up adopting. Take a breath because things really start to grow from here, but also if you've followed Yellowstone from the beginning, you kind of know what's coming. John fathers Lee, Beth, and Casey Dutton. Lee dies in the first episode of Yellowstone, but Beth and Casey find partners. In fact, Casey and Monica are responsible for two-thirds of the Teal generation. That's Tate and baby John, who died in the car accident in season five. The adopted Jamie hooks up with Christina, and together they have a baby boy whose name is either Jamie or Michael. That's never really made clear. Jamie is his name, but his birth father actually gave him the name Michael, so it really could be either one. Okay, now that you've heard the long version, it's time for the uninterrupted 30 second long short version that I promised. Give me a thumbs up if you think I got it right, or be sure to let me know in the comments section below if you think we made a mistake. We'll update this as needed at tasteofcountry.com and talk about additions and corrections of the Dutton Rules podcast. Links in the description section below. I'm Billy Deuce for Taste of Country. Thanks for watching and thanks for subscribing.